What is up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. We're chasing some kabooms. You guys see that CJ Stroud right there, guys? Yeah, that was hit by breaking one of these on our Instagram channel last week or so, guys. So, uh, from a different case, we were opening these up as personals. We actually hit a CJ Stroud kaboom, guys. So, hey, let's chase some kabooms, guys. Obviously, no guarantee, but fact is that we pulled a CJ Stroud out of one case. Doesn't mean we can't pull one out of another case or maybe another similar kaboom of a big quarterback, big player. So, of course, uh, chasing some good booms. 32 total spots. Everybody gets around team NFL member. No vet common ship. Um, and, of course, look for a Mega Box exclusive parallels. Um, find ultra rare kabooms and explosive inserts. And, of course, it looks like you can get one autograph or memorabilia card per box. Now, this is Mega Box edition, so a lot cheaper, of course, than absolute football as a hobby. But a uh, pretty nice one here, guys. Let's get it going. And it's also a promo break. If these breaks out by tomorrow night. We can give away $2,000, so that'll be one break taken off the board there. So I already have the people here that I'll paste in after the break is over. So uh, now let's uh, get a list going here, and let's pr uh, roll. And it's a five and a four nine times. Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and nine. Five, four, nine, nine. Karen down to J. Five, four, nine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Nine times, nine times. Jaguars down to the Patriots. There you go. Nine times, nine times. All right, so Karen, you got the Jacksonville Jaguars. Tristan with the Steelers. Joseph with the uh, Browns. Eric, you got the Jets. Aaron with the Giants. Joe Lawson, you got the Bills. Josh with the Falcons. Michael with the Raiders. Jake with the Texans. Chad with the Rams. Eric with the Ravens. Joe, you got the Titans. Jay with the Dolphins as well as the Saints. Michael with the 49ers. Joe with the Bucks, Chiefs, and Commanders. Allen with the uh, Chargers. Tristan with the Eagles. Um, Joe, you got the Seahawks. Josh with the Colts. Joe with the Packers and Lions. Jay with the Panthers and Cowboys. Michael with the Vikings. Tristan with the Cardinals. Joe with the Broncos. Richard with the Bears. Michael with the Bengals. And then Jay with the Patriots. All right. So... Let's paste this in here really quick. All right, I'll give you guys a quick minute if you guys want to make any trades. If not, stick to what you got, guys. Jordan got three in the Chasing Mahomes. Thanks, sir. And Will got into Formula One. Thank you. What you get yourself? Perfect? Yeah. Nice.
All right, I'm assuming no trades, I guess. It's right, TWC. Bye. Jay, good luck, buddy. Congr uh, good luck, man. Let's go grab a knife, dude. Someone took my knife today again. Come on, Case. This case is so long, dude. It's like crazy. It's like, I think I'm gonna flip it this way. Oh, I got one already. Hold on, guys. I'm gonna put the camera over here to the side. Last thing I wanted to do is drop this camera, all these boxes on this camera. Woo. All right, empty case. But all the boxes are right here. Boxes right there, guys. All 20. All right, again, it's a 20 box case, guys. So, uh, hopefully, we get a kaboom, guys, or at least an explosive. I'm not sure. I've never broken, actually, I don't think I've ever broken Absolute Megas. So I'm not really sure what to fully expect, but I guess it gets one autograph or one mem. So I guess at least there'll be 20 hits. Probably rip like 10 boxes at a time. And we'll go through the rest after. Is there any NBA All Star festivities today? Oh, really? Oh, hell yeah. I don't know what's in this only, Chad. I don't know if you can only get the horizontals or not, to be honest. Oh shit, Puka Nakua's in there. So is Micah? F Micah Parsons. But Teddy did pull a horizontal kaboom, so maybe, maybe uh, you are right. I'm not sure though.
Okay, perfect, yeah. How you doing, Chad? Have you already recovered from all those, those sports and now just moving towards Mariners baseball now? And how's the new job? I mean, I don't know if it's... I mean, it's still new, right, I guess. But have you settled in already? Job's great, but it's taking all your time. Oh, so is this uh, this job so far is a little how uh, how's you doing a little bit more than you normally would? Well, one month today. Gotcha. It is a longer drive though, right? Yeah. Actually, I want to record this. What does that even mean, Chad? <laughs> what does that even mean? <laughs> to our shop. <laughs> sure thing, buddy. Be careful, buddy.
All right, guys, three more boxes, and then we'll go through the cards. Not many cards per box, but having to rip every single box and then stack them up and keep them in the same box and rip the packs. A little time consuming, but... All right, here we go. Puka Nakua. Jamar Chase Relic. Burner's Relic. For the uh, Bengals going to Michael. So the, all of these are gonna be pretty much the same, guys. I mean, I don't think there's gonna be anything crazy wowzer. Of course, we're hoping for like a kaboom, but or an explosive. But I think most boxes, I wouldn't doubt if we're gonna be more relics. But hopefully, we get some boxes with autos. But since it is more on the retail side, it's more than likely we'll probably get more relics than anything. Will Levis, nice by Storm. And how about CJ Stroud? We'll take that relic though. Houston Texans going to Jake. That's number to 399 as well. Got a Will Levis rookie. Anthony Richardson. Zach Charbonnet, rookie force relic. Seahawks. That's going to Joe. Roderick Jones. Deion Sanders. And then introductions, cool hands for Jackson Smith and the Jigba. Bryce Young, Randy Moss. And then we got a Raheem Oster to one four ninety nine.
And then a Jordan Allison relic for the Minnesota Vikings. Going to Michael L. Jay with the Carolina Panthers for this Bryce Young. Josh Downs. Relic there for the Colts. Whoa! We got one! Kaboom! Tua Togavailoa. For the Dolphins, and look at that, Jay. Jay saying first time doing this, and this is awesome. Well, hopefully we just uh, reeled you in because you just got this Tua kaboom with your Dolphins. There you go, man. We got Josh Allen, tools of the trade relic to three ninety nine for the Bills and Joe Jackson Smith and the Jigba rookie, Jameer Gibbs. Jordan Addison, Luke Shoemaker to four ninety-nine. Hurts. Dalton Kincaid by Storm. And a Tyreek Hill for the Chiefs Championship Fabrics. Chiefs going to Joe. Dalton Kincaid. Bijan. Stefan Diggs. Marquise Brown. Best receiver in the league, baby. Oh, man. I don't know where it Went healthy, right? By storm, Jordan Addison. Flash. Jameer Gibbs relic. Rookie force. Lions, that's going to Joe.
All right, last box here, and these two are just little kid reporters. And Tyree Wilson for the Raiders. Going to Michael L. Dijon. Talking the shop. By Storm, Jameer Gibbs. guys so first 10 boxes all relics couple of them numbered including a cj strout but we did get a kaboom in the first half now i don't know if we're gonna find another one but still gotta do the second half right find out Celebrity All-Star game going on right now.
What's up, Oliver? You ready to get to Vegas or what? Here at the shop? Yeah, I got here like at 3.05. Like literally at 3.05. I got a little bit of traffic today. Oh, tomorrow, gotcha. My mom just got there today. And my brother-in-law, my niece and them. They're staying at the New York, New York, I think. Where are you going to be at? You, you're, you're going for fun, right? Or is it like maybe a kids tournament or something like that? Yeah, I mean, I wanted to join in, but I'd have to go on Sunday, Sunday, Monday, you know? Which I still could. Maybe I could try to convince my wife she wants to go. We don't really have plans, but... Oh, nice, nice, yeah. Yeah, a lot of my uh, Caesars rewards, like casinos, are pretty cheap right now, like... With my points, I mean, I can get, like, Planet Hollywood and all those ones pretty cheap. Baseball. Where do they play baseball at? Is there a big, like, baseball complex out there? Yeah, my, I mean, my mom tagged along with my brother-in-law and my niece and them because my niece played uh, travel volleyball for like ever, but her senior year this year, she just wanted to kind of focus on the high school volleyball that she, that she did already and then also just focus more on like, you know, where she's going to go to school. She ended up, she uh, she got into a nursing program at, uh, at uh, Mount St. Mary's, so that's where she's going to end up going, but... But as one of her good friends still plays on that travel uh, volleyball tournament team, whatever, so she's just there to kind of relax, but also to kind of support her too. So they're there for like a volleyball tournament technically, but my brother-in-law was like, yeah, like I don't have to wake up like so early and be there for like 13 hours, you know? I'm sure you know what freaking tournament grinds are. I was like, yeah, that's tough, dude. So they're enjoying that they can actually just go when they play and watch a game or so that's it then I have to be there literally for like 12 13 hours and then you're just so tired that you just don't even want to do anything when you get there oh nice yeah I, I forget where it's I mean last time they went it was at uh, Mandalay Bay I think but but yeah no, it's definitely grind well well a few years ago they had one in Arizona because I was like oh perfect Arizona I can go to that one you know so I planned it out perfectly, and like I was staying in my my mother in law's house and stuff like that. But man, one time we had to go like at seven in the morning, and then like they played again like at five in the afternoon, and uh, that shit was tiring, dude. I was like, well, obviously, you know, if ever have kids that want to be in tournaments like that, sports, I'll definitely do it for them. But sheesh, <laughs> it's a grind. Yeah, no, it is fun though, actually. I mean, the tournament vibe aspect is kind of cool, right? I mean, there's like hundreds of schools or hundreds of different, you know, players from all over the place. Like, one time when we went to the one in Arizona, there was some freaking kids from like Alaska. Literally, coming to this tournament. It's like, what the hell, dude? It's crazy. Y'all are wild. Alrighty, guys. Let's see if we can hit another kaboom or maybe an explosive in this half. All right, there's CJ Stroud. Will Levis. 
little Jimmy Gibbs ripping some cards. Rogers. Quentin Johnson. And Tyler Scott. Yeah, there was a lot of traffic getting out of Long Beach today because uh, Cali Vibes is this weekend. I think like Gwen Stefani's today, plus some other bands, other artists. I think Sublime is tomorrow with some other ones. And then it's like, I think Snoop Dogg or, or Ice Cube are on there this weekend too. Uh, Dorian Thompson Robinson. Kirby. Yeah, right there by the pike, man. Rashad Bateman at 299. Frank Tarkinson. <laughs> Jesus Christ. It's all star games. Wow. Bryce Young. Triple relic there to 399. That's going to go to the Panthers and Jay. Doing it all. I think that's that Tyler Scott. Yeah, so every game is fun. I just want to see CJ Stroud and Micah just go at it. Oh, hit a three, too. Four pointer. <laughs> CJ just missed horribly. Oh, and one. Gabe Davis. Tools of the Trade Relic to 399. Joe with the Bills. I know, CJ CJ trying a little too hard right now, dude. I think he took offense to like my Michael Parsons basically saying like you weren't that good in high school. And he's like, What are you talking about, bro? Like I beat Jaime Hake I got like forty points against Jaime Hakez. Yeah, meta, meta definitely out of shape, and I mean, obviously it's it's normal, right? After you play ball, you're gonna gain some weight. Oh, snap! You know what's funny though? It, it's you. You know what's hilarious? You know what's funny though is that it's usually those athletes. I'm not saying every single athlete, because there's a lot of athletes that stay in shape for the rest of their life. You know, they probably have great metabolism and stuff like that, too. But I think it's so funny because I've noticed that, like, in NFL players, the players that tend to get bigger when they retire and probably do nothing is, like, the actually, like, very, very in shape ones, right? Like, running backs and, and receivers and stuff like that, that. You know, they gain a lot of weight. But it's so funny because I've noticed in the NFL, a lot of linemen, once they retire, dude, they, they freaking drop so much weight. And are just like so fit, and obviously, I'm sure they, they gotta they gotta keep that weight up, right? Because they're linemen, they gotta stay like in the 300 pound range, you know, whatever. But once they retire, dude, they just crazy. Like Lane Johnson posted up a photo yesterday for the Eagles. You know, he's just like you know year 13, he's freaking flexing. Dude has a six pack, freaking you know just looks like a tight end more than anything than a lineman. I'm just like, that dude, obviously, when he retires, he's probably going to be so fit. Oh, we got an autograph. Drew Sanders to 75. For the Broncos. Broncos is uh, Joe. But yeah, Lyman end up getting really skinny. Playing 
Batum, Bryce Young, Devontae. All right, four more boxes, guys. So I did see we had another one of these, but I don't know if we're going to use it for here or not. I got to double check, but if you guys like it, can post another one. If, if As long as it's not being used somewhere else. I think it's a fun break. It's pretty cheap for the most part. Obviously, you're really hoping for that one kaboom to go to your team, but at the same time, I mean, you're still getting at least one relic in every box. Like I said, not a pricey break at all. Anthony Richardson, by Storm, but hey, Jimmy G got busted for PEDs, did you believe that? Probably took him to freaking recover from his injuries, but still. Mike Evans Relic, Championship Fabric. Tampa Bay Buccaneers going to Joe. Will Levis. Jameer Gibbs. Got a little West Coast Boys. Jackson Smith and the Jigba. Miles Garrett's a big man, dude. That's a good dog. He's not in this one, right? He was in last year's, I think, or whatever year it was when it was in Cleveland. Shit was wild. That's a big dude right there. Jonathan Mingo. For the Panthers. Piastri, future uh, Frutero, uh... Auto, Piastri had a 1 out of 25 insert orange, gold rookie, and a 5 number Piastri. Damn. That's wild. Gardner, baby. Numbered there. Or. And Chris Olave. Jalen Carter by Storm. All righty, guys. So hey guys, you know, only one kaboom came out of this case, but we got one at least. Um, obviously a lot of numbered cards too, handful of them, and obviously one relic. We did get one autograph though. Um, but like I said, it's, it's retail guys, I really only expected one, maybe two autographs. I was just hoping for more of the kabooms. Like I said, these retail mega boxes are not expensive at all. It's like under $100, I think it's like $50 or $60 a box. Compared to an absolute hobby box, that's like six, seven hundred dollars. So, one auto, one kaboom, and like I said, it was a promo break. So for the people that are in this break, you still get a chance to uh, potentially win back some money. Um, but like I said, retail wise, most likely, even though it says one auto, one relic, you're most likely gonna get a relic. But like I said, still came out with twenty relics though. A couple of them are, are from the same team, duplicate players, duplicate teams. But like I said, all in all, still fun break to rip. Got one kaboom. Uh, like I said, I'll paste in your guys' name um, into the promo list. Like I said, we can sell out those four breaks by tomorrow night. Uh, you guys will get a chance to uh, win some money back, guys. So let's get the next one rolling. Thank you, guys.